Qualcomm is jumping in on AI for smartphones. The industry looking to artificial intelligence to re-accelerate sales. Yahoo Finance's Dan Howley joins us for more. Dan, what are the details? That's right, Jared. This is the Snapdragon 8 Elite, the new Qualcomm chip uh, that will be available for smartphones. Uh, and it really is focused heavily on AI and AI capabilities. This is something that smartphone makers are continuing to push as the next real selling point for their devices, AI and onboard AI in particular. And Qualcomm says that this chip will allow smartphone makers to offer just that, AI that runs on the phone and doesn't necessarily need to always go to the cloud. Now that doesn't mean that companies won't still offer cloud-based AI on their devices, but they will be able to offer more onboard as well. And so that includes things like uh, removing unwanted objects from video rather than just photos, something that would have required cloud capabilities prior. And so we're gonna continue to see more of these companies adding more AI to their devices. Apple's expected to roll out its whole Apple intelligent platform uh, sometime next week, uh, according to uh, various reports. Uh, and with this chip in particular, you can expect to see it potentially in Samsung's upcoming Galaxy S25 device. Uh, those generally come out uh, around the January, February timeframe. Dan, have you seen yet the killer app that leverages and takes advantage of, of AI that makes you think, you know what, I got to upgrade? Nothing in particular quite yet has really driven me in, in personally to say, okay, I need this device because of, of AI. Uh, I've been using some of the beta uh, features for Apple intelligence. Um, you know, the summaries for notifications is very helpful. Uh, summaries for emails uh, is very helpful. But I, I don't know if that's necessarily something that is going to get people to say, yeah, I really want this. I, I still think it's mostly the hardware that gets people out the door, uh, whether that's the, the camera, the screen, or the battery. Uh, I've used Google's uh, Gemini. Uh, again, those are great features uh, uh, included in that, uh, but it's, it's not necessarily something that really makes me say, okay, I have to go out and buy this. In fact, the, the main reason why I would pick up a Pixel is because of the, the Pixel uh, 9 Fold. And that I think has more to do obviously with the fact that it's a foldable phone with a great design rather than the, the AI software that it has to offer. Dan, great to see you. Thank you, appreciate it.